I know someone named Cole. Cole's the kid who got my daughter pregnant. Oh. Oh. Star's boyfriend. The ex-boyfriend. He dumped her. Um, why? I'm not sure, to tell you the truth. I didn't hear it from her. She's not talking to me. Right. Well, you did say you didn't like this boy. No. And I knew he was trouble from the beginning. I mean, having sex with a minor is bad enough, but he was a drug user. They had an incident one night, and he attacked her. Kind of like what happened to you. Oh, my. Are you saying that he raped her? You're one tough cookie, aren't you? Well, you know, pregnant. No kidding. Makes me a little moody. So you're married? I was. Um, my husband was murdered. I'm sure you read about it in the papers. My God. You said Jessica Brennan. I should have put it together. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's okay. Um, my husband's death kind of uh, laid me low for a little bit. But I'm ready to start a new project, you know? Keep my mind busy. Sure, I get that. You know, new beginnings and all. Mm. That's how you rebuild your life, right? Yeah, I guess. But what, what, what exactly is this project, anyway? It's kind of a labor of love. You know, to honor my dead husband's memory. And kind of a payback. I really enjoy spending time with Bree. Yeah, she's like the only person that's too upset all the time. You know, I think Sarah really likes having her mom back. And I like Tina. Yeah, you're gonna try to smooth things over with Jess about Tina staying here? I'll do what I can, but, you know, Jess has a mind of her own these days. I'm kidding. And she's not crazy about someone. You know what? I think you should let Tina fight her own battles. She seems up for the job. Well, if I do that, then how will I fill the time? I don't know. I feel like I can't even put my hands on you when Jessica's around. Well... I know it's not been easy for you, but... Well, so she's not around. What? His name just slipped out, all right? I mean, look, they both have four letters, and they both start with, with C. Uh-huh. Well, it does not mean that I'm still pining away for your father. So what does it mean? That I'm a ditz. What? Look, what do you want me to say? That your father is the love of my life? Was he? Of course he was. So there they were in front of everybody, standing at the altar. Okay, Tina and Max. Tina and Max, <laughs> yeah. But Tina, during her, uh, during her vows, she said Cord's name instead of Max's. Oh, my God, you're kidding me. Yeah, so Max called the wedding off right there. Well, I guess <laughs> understandable. Well, eventually, I did marry Tina again and again. <laughs> Never quite took. Oh. I guess some things are just not meant to be. Let's not blow this out of proportion. <laughs> but, but, Mom, you just said that... I, I know. That your father is the love of my life. So what? It doesn't matter anymore. Don't you see? I lost him. Forever. Then yeah, no, on. Hey, Antonio. Blair. John. Hey. I'm gonna call to check on uh, Jamie. Let me know when uh, when your FBI contact arrives. Okay? Sure. Damn it. Who's that? It's my ex-husband. He's a total pain in the ass. So what's happening? I kind of made a real stupid mistake. You? I don't believe it. Oh, this is great. I haven't told you yet. You're already making fun of me. It's over. Well, whatever it is, it sure does something to do with Manning. Doesn't it always? <laughs>